Hey guys, it's Julia, and I'm sorry I look like really like not okay today, but today is Monday, and I have no school today, so I've kind of just been laid back and chilling. But anyways, today I'm going to be doing a room tour for you guys, and I've been waiting to do this video for a while, and I'm really excited to finally be able to do it. Because I love the way my room looks. The reason I didn't do it straight after was because there was still things that I wanted to add here and there. Yeah, I think I'm done. There are a couple things that I'm going to take down or things that I'm going to add. But I'll just give you guys that in a room updates video or just some room updates randomly in another random video that I do in the future. Um, but today I'm going to be doing a room tour and showing you guys what I have right now so yeah i hope you guys enjoy the video and let's just jump straight into it all right so here is my door now i would show you guys the outside however there's nothing hanging on the outside or no decoration on the outside yet so i have this little hook that my mom gave me and um a couple of bags here um and these are just some purses these are the only purses i own so it's four of them and that might be a lot for some people, it might be a little for some. It's a lot for me because I don't use purses, I'm more of like a backpack person. Um, but yeah, this is just hanging on my door. And then I've got some hangers here as well. Tonight I'll plan what outfit I'm going to wear to school and hang it here. So next to my door on the left side, I just have this poster which you guys might have seen. I did upload a video if you guys want to check it out um, on my art channel. And it's just a mandala poster that I made. And I still just have it hanging here. I haven't made a lot of videos in front of it. It's supposed to be a background. But I haven't made a lot of videos in front of it. So I just kind of still have it hanging here because it was a lot of work. And I do still like how it looks. But I don't know. <laughs> it's just there. Okay, so next to that, and my head's kind of cut off. But next to that, I have my shelf. And then here at the bottom, I have my... Um, cat food in this kind of like um mexican piece of felt and all the felts that are around my room are from mexico um and then i have the two cat bowls and um yeah because my cat eats and sleeps in here i have another piece of felt here swung over my um shelf this is probably one of the favorite parts of my room because I don't know, I just like how it's decorated. Next here, in this wooden box, I have my National Geographic things. So that's the National Geographic magazines and the like posters and things like that because I'm a nerd. Um, I have my yearbook and I have like my ceramics and then my books here with some roses that I got for my quinceanera and they're dying. <laughs> well, they already are dead. Here I have a bunch of like games, um, like what is this um headbands and then some puzzles as well as jenga and then here at the very bottom i have all the animal things so i have the dog's medical bills and papers the dog leashes and grooming supplies and treats and all that fun stuff um dog kits so yeah i just have my shelf here um at the top i just have this brick which was from a retreat i went to and then I have these little knickknacks that are actually from Mexico, the panda included. And you'll see a lot of those pandas around my room. <laughs> um, but yeah, these turtles and this panda are from Mexico. And then I have this little like light up flower thing. Um, it's not on, but it does light up. There we go. Um, and then I have some paintings that my brother actually made, um, which he gave to me. Um, they're just paintings of the beach because it really reminds me of Mexico. Um, you guys can't see that, but I have a mask from a traditional Mexican character, La Catrina. I've got, um, Mexican money, and then as well as, um, a Hawaiian flower garland from my 8th grade promotion. <laughs> okay, this is my desk, and it's kind of a weird angle to show it from, but this is my desk. Um, up here I have all my quinceanera things, um pretty self-explanatory these are like the boots i wore to my quinceanera and i have all the cards um on there my signed album my two crowns so this is the crown that i got changed into and then the flower crown that i was wearing um and just kind of those things and then at the bottom i have like just some random desk things i have the aml logo and some pictures 
And then I have some colored pencils here, which aren't on my art desk because they're like Crayola pencils. They're more like for school projects. This is a drawer, my favorite drawer. Um, basically, excuse me, it opens up like this and then you can pull it out. And I have a mess in here, but um, yeah, I have my historical atlas by National Geographic. Just some random things in here, like, I don't know, really random. <laughs> but yeah, I didn't really change my desk too much. All I did was add my quinceanera things because, I don't know, I just didn't want to decorate my desk because I work here, so. <laughs> Alright, so here is my YouTube desk, I guess you could say. This is kind of, this is a corner desk, and the reason I like this desk so much, I have three different desks in my room, by the way. I know that might seem like a lot, but that's just, that's how I do it. So, I like this corner desk because when I edit videos, in this like corner of my room it, I kind of concentrate better I like to write here as well because I am a writer I guess and then I have a little chalkboard sign that says YouTube desk AML creative corner I have this little like um, wooden frame with the letter J on it you know for my name and um, yeah it just has some drawings on it but yeah basically this is normally where I'll edit I'll write here as well so I've got my jar here, which is full of a bunch of um, earphone cables, um, which are like chargers for my earphones. And then I have all my earphones here. Um, and then this like stand. And then I have this little like um, leaf full of a bunch of cables and things. And then the main thing is just decorated with another um, felt from Mexico. And I've got my speakers and portable chargers, just random things like that this is my nightstand and yeah i really love my nightstand um and then i just have this lamp here which i got from target all of the new things i got in my room are from target and i have another little wooden frame here with a family picture on it basically it's just my nightstand you know it has what nightstands have in it um and this is like my junk drawer i have a bunch of random stuff in there um, but yeah, there's nothing really to explain about my nightstand. It's just kind of, it's just kind of there. Um, and then obviously my window, um, is behind here. And then I just have these sheer white curtains and these are also from Target. And I also have some fairy lights lining my curtains just because I like the way it looks. I don't usually have them on in the day. I usually just have them on at night. Um, but yeah, basically that's it. So then I just have my bed. It's probably the most like Mexican fied part of my room. I just have like all my stuffed animals and stuff, which I'll go over super fast. So I have this um panda laying down. You can't see him, but like he runs the whole thing of my bed. And my aunt gave this to me. My auntie, she lives in um, LA. So she gave that to me. And then for my quinceanera. And then I have these pillows. Um, probably my favorite pillows because they really remind me of Mexico. Um, I have this one with some flower patterns on it, which my grandma sews. And then, and she lives in Mexico. And then I have this plain white pillow, um, and I added some safety pins to the back so I could add another Mexican felt. Um, and then I have a bunch of just stuffed animals, a panda, a cow, my emoji pillows, um, which I don't show. Those are just kind of there to hold up the pillows. And then I have... This giant teddy bear that my auntie slash godmother gave me, um, the one you guys see right there, um, for my quinceanera. And that's probably one of my favorite stuffed animals as well, just because of the little um, dress it's wearing. Covers are also from Target, but we bought them like a long time ago. They're actually like this pattern. Um, and this is a pattern I chose a long time ago when I had like a baby blue room. Um, and I kind of just flipped it over because I wanted a blanket that looked like a quilt, but white. I have um, another Mexican felt, and these are a little more expensive because they're like the bigger ones. And they're actually like, this is actually what they look like in Mexico. <laughs> um, but yeah, and then up here I have these little like, this banner that I made, and it says good night. And I have some pictures with my dogs here. Um, not my, They're not all my dogs, but... This one here is my auntie's dog, the one that gave me the panda bear. That's my auntie's dog in LA. And this here is a dog that I had when I was younger. Um, her name's Darla. We don't have her anymore, but um, 
yeah, she was one of my favorite dogs. And then this is the dog I have right now, um, my German Shepherd Alpha. So that's cool. Um, and yeah, and then of course I have another Mexican felt hanging there. Um, so I want my art desk, probably the place where I spend the most time, um, the whole day. I only do art here, like I don't write here or do my homework here. I just don't like to because there's there's a purpose for this desk and I like to use it for the purpose it's there for. It's just my art desk. Um, like I said, spend a lot of time here. Um, and my room was built in the garage, so a lot of people ask me like, do I ever get cold? And I think one of the main reasons that I got used to this place is because I spent so much time at this desk that I don't even notice because I'm just like busy doing my stuff. So I'm not going to go over it into a whole lot of detail because I am going to be doing a desk tour, art desk tour on my art channel. Um, but yeah, basically I have these um, things which I don't know where they bought them. We took them from the neighbors. And then I have this lamp here for when I draw and that's from Target for sure. Um, another chalkboard and then I have some cardboard canvases um, these are more like crafting supplies um, and then at the bottom I have a bunch of other supplies as well but yeah this is basically my art desk like I said I won't go into too much detail um, I've got the logo and then this Mickey Mouse that I painted inside a Campbell soup can because you gotta love soup so I've got my vanity here and not vanity um, what do you call this oh my dresser <laughs> and this is actually the first um, vanity type dresser I've ever had so I don't really know how to talk um, about this and when I have had a vanity I've never had anything on it um, because I don't wear makeup um, I don't like like I don't know I'm just I'm really different from my sister if you will she's like makeup hand sanitizers and like lotions obviously I wear lotions obviously I wear deodorant but like that's about it <laughs> um, but yeah, this is the first, like, I don't know. It's just weird for me to have this. But anyways, I have all my makeup, which my sister gave me for my 15th birthday. This was her present to me. I wear it, like, maybe once every two weeks. Um, and if, you'll if you're lucky, you'll see me wearing makeup all week. But that's, like, when I'm having a really bad face day. I have this AC, which is for when it's really, really hot because it gets super hot in here. But... Um, when it's cold, it gets super cold in here, so I can't turn it on because it's like freezing in here. So I have some fairy lights, the little fairy light battery pack, and they're running up here along this quote that says broken crayons still color. And then I have a bunch of like just pictures here. Yep. And then I have another chalkboard, this nail, which is hanging all my um, necklaces, all of them, just three. And then I have all my makeup and stuff like that random things. I have this saltstone lamp which I'm actually going to get rid of. Um, I kind of want to do a story time on it but I'm a little scared to. Um, but yeah, I'll turn it on for like three seconds but I'm scared to turn it on. There you go. Um, it's a rock and basically you put oil in it and it makes your whole room smell like that oil. Drawer. Um, I have like this box full of a bunch of random stuff. In this drawer I have um, like some more makeup, baby wipes and Things like that. I have a whole lot of makeup that I don't use just because my sister gave me a lot of it that I don't even know how to use. Of course, I have my clothes in here and at the very bottom underneath this, I have my shoes. And then if you guys were wondering what's here, you guys can't see it, but there is something here between my art desk and my thing. Um, I have my school backpack. I don't know where it got bought um, and I put a little Mexican fabric on it again. And I use this for my art desk, my corner desk, and my... Um, Thing here so I just kind of keep it here it's really easy to move so yeah <laughs> my, my vanity I have all my lotions here and then another light up plant right here um and then here I just have this file thing which has all our school all me and my siblings old school stuff and then I just have like my to-go backpack this is a backpack I take everywhere but um yeah this is the last part, this is the last part of my room. I don't even know what to say anymore. Like, <laughs> there's a room tour. Oh my god. There's the room tour, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, so, yeah, all of this, um, 
this whole room makeover was made possible by my mother um because a lot of like the mexican fabrics i used or like the pictures all of those were given to me by my mother which were used to decorate my quinceanera i also want to state out there before you guys say that like i'm spoiled or something like that um everything i have in here is from like years to come and like have been gifts for my birthdays and stuff and some things that my mom has bought me here and there the things i bought um, like all the new lamps, the fairy lights, uh, the frames, um, all of that was bought with my own money. My whole room makeover was made possible under $100, so everything together was $74.99, so $75 for everything in here, and I paid it with my own money, so I don't, I'm just putting that out there, like, I'm not trying to brag in any way, but I'm also very thankful for the people that gave me money for my birthday. This is my room. I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, I will be updating you guys if I add anything in here. I know I want to add some pictures, but my pictures from my 15th birthday haven't come yet. Um, because those are the really special pictures <laughs> that I want to add. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, just, just my room. So, thank you guys for watching. Um, stay tuned and make sure to go subscribe to my other channel as well as this one. Um, make sure to subscribe to my art channel julia.aml so you guys can see the art desk tour um and yeah thank you guys so much for watching click that thumbs up button and i'll catch you guys in my next video bye <laughs>